The author of the passage attributes the influence of British periodicals in shaping public opinion in the 19th century in part two. So here, if we look at lines four and five, six, even that area, we see it was during the 1800s that mass distribution became possible. An explosion in periodical readership occurred, vastly increasing magazines' opinion shaping powers. Key part here is mass distribution. Mass distribution is important because it shows us that, okay, mag magazine circulation increased because there were more magazines. Mass distribution. Now we can go through the answer choices and we're going to arrive at answer choice C, which says changes in the way in which magazines were distributed. And what is that way? Well, they were now distributed on a mass scale. So C is our answer. We do not want to get trapped by some other answer choices here. So if we look here, at answer choice B, it says an increase in the relative number of readers from the middle and upper classes. So we like B at first. You see how it says an increase in the relative number of readers. So, oh, that makes sense, right? British periodicals increase because of the number of readers. But does it ever specifically say from the middle and upper classes? And the answer is no. And that's why B is wrong, because it makes the mistake of adding this extra information about the middle and the upper classes. So again, the answer is C.